Welcome to another episode of Foodie Friday. This week we're in Pittsville showing off their best kept secret, Boxcar 40, a place with food that you just have to try. Let's check them out. Great place. Been coming here since it opened. I love it here. It's one of the best places that I've been to in a while. There's no doubt that locals love Boxcar 40. Oh, I love this place. It, it's excellent for us coming out here on Thursdays. Have a great time and they treat us very well. In fact, one group of guys known as the Burger Boys love it so much, they come every Thursday. We can have two things to eat. You can have a hamburger or a cheeseburger. We had we had somebody come out and ordered pulled pork. We never invite them back. We, we try to be somewhat in clandestine here, so we refer to ourselves as the poetry group because we don't want the wives to know what we're doing. So any place that has such a loyal following has to have good food, right? That answer is a resounding yes, largely thanks to this man right here, Paul Supley, the chef and proprietor who just wants people to enjoy good food. If one table wants to dress up and feel comfortable, it's great. Other table wants to come in and flip flops and t-shirt, that's perfect. I want people to come in um, and really just feel like they're home. At Boxcar, you can get everything from a steak to a sandwich, and all of it is tasty. But for us, Paul whipped up two favorites. The first, Mikey T's Smokehouse Boom Boom, the brainchild of one of Paul's younger cooks. He came to me with the sandwich idea, and he told me what was on it, and I'm like, yeah, we're doing that. We're definitely doing that. The sandwich features their 16-hour smoked brisket, jalapenos, fried onions, cheddar cheese, and Alabama white sauce stuffed between two pieces of Texas toast. And after trying it, it was no wonder why it's a fan favorite. Are you kidding me, man? All these different flavors. Mm -hmm. It's like a flavor explosion in your mouth. Mm -hmm. The second favorite we tried, Boxcar Seafood Risotto, which featured blackened tuna and shrimp and a creamy risotto that's topped with a basil puree. And quite simply put, it's a dish that you'll want to have time and time again. Yeah. That's phenomenal, man. Very good. I mean, that's risotto is creamy, delicious. Tuna's cooked right, nice seasoning on there. What more could you want? But don't just take it from us. Boxcar's food turns anyone into an instant fan. It's just that good. Unbelievable. <laughs> we love brisket. We love ribs. This melts in your mouth. I mean, literally. We returned to the States after being away a couple of years, and oh my gosh, <laughs> it is good. 